The world of exponential technology is not something we can turn off. The switch is on. So that raises real questions for those of us who care about human connection, respect for nature, and truly using that for good, how to design for the outcomes that we want. The promise of technology is really great, but only if done with heart. Coming from Silicon Valley, most people are in love with tech, and so most of the time you see a lot of like, bright ideas happen where they think about the tech and then they find the problem. It should really be the other way around. You need to fall in love with the problem and have that passion to solve that problem using tech. I think when you're developing new technologies, you really want to think about the people that are going to use them, and not just to, in order to get them to use your technology, but in terms of the impact that your technical development is going to have on those people. And you're well served to stay humble and remember to stop and listen and be open so that it becomes part of a broader you know, movement towards a better future. Everyone's been talking about how Artificial intelligence and robotics and machine learning is going to replace a lot of jobs and replace a lot of humans, and there's a lot of fear right now about technology that comes from that as well. But I think if we do it right, it actually gives us the opportunity to express our humanity even more. And we can focus on empathy, human connection, leadership skills, changing the world for a better place, and seeing how technology can help with that. There's a book called What Technology Wants, which is really interesting, looking from a technology perspective, what technology wants, as if it's this separate entity uh, that has a life force of its own. And some would even argue that. My question is, what does humanity want? And therein, to be clear about that, and then what role technology can have. It's a completely different way of looking at the world while respecting that there is this very powerful dynamic of exponential technology that we would be naive not to recognize and not to anticipate where it's going in the future.